Wayne, you're back on. So what do you do with those trailers? I remodel them. If the flooring dog is played, uh, I take all the flooring out from the walls under, and then I put new quarter inch, three quarter inch plywood, tongue and groove, and quarter inch plywood on top of it, from one end to the back. So it's 14 by 80, that's 33 sheets of plywood, and then that way you'll have no patching like your club on park and dealers use it. They just patch a hole, mm -hmm. and that's it. And you got problems later on in the years. And we place all the sheetrock. Uh, the foundings that get holes in them, it's best to take them off mm -hmm. and put sheetrock on it. The same way tiled on the ceiling. Put a tile in or your choice. Mm -hmm. Put the fixtures in if they need it. And that, that'll complete because the uh, mobile home park, a mobile home dealership, like aspirin and homework and all the rest of them, mm -hmm. they mm -hmm. patch them up. They sell one for about $25,000 for that price, I can rebottle one and give it out to a person on low income or to a veteran. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And a whole lot cheaper. And do they have to sign a contract? How does this all work? No, only thing I ask for is um, your income, how many people within the family, and how many rooms do you want? Uh, one, two, three bedroom, and how many bathrooms? Mm -hmm. One bed, one bathroom, one half, or two bathrooms. Mm -hmm. And that's it. Yeah. So then, how much does it cost them usually? I mean, this is a roundabout estimate. To rebuild a home, roughly around maybe fifteen to twenty thousand dollars. Wow. So how do you try to get these funds to come in? What do you it's do? It's from individual businesses, any place that I'm able to raise up the money. Cause right now, everything coming in my own pocket, just to move them. And how much does it cost you a day just to move one trailer? Well, fuel and everything, like right now I got tires, tires of $500 for used tires, or, you know, up to $2,000 or more, or mm -hmm. $5,000 for a brand new one. Mm -hmm. And you're looking around maybe for the permit, $42 for uh, four days. Mm -hmm. And then your uh, fuel, that's a hundred and, $150 for fuel, which I can pull on this truck here, maybe three mobile homes. Mm, goodness, goodness. That's about it. And how much, how much does it, uh, if you have to travel out of town, how much more does it cost? Like Oolagal, for instance. Well, Tulsa, where I go to get them all, Tulsa to my place, mm -hmm. I can maybe move two mobile homes. Because you're looking at about maybe five to seven miles per gallon on a 50 pound tank. Right. Now, do you ask them to volunteer to help you and assist you with this type yeah. of... Yeah, because we're not able to pay it. Because we're not 501c mm -hmm. church uh, mm -hmm. organization. Uh, everything comes with what money we can get. Mm -hmm. we... But you are working on that, yeah. correct? We're working on yeah, getting... Yeah, we're trying to get people involved in it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like, so we're getting... Uh, we need volunteers mm -hmm. to help train and just assemble, get them out. Mm -hmm. And we need a uh, electrician, plumber. I got born in the house. Mm -hmm. I got here in Bartlesville. Yeah. It's a 14 by 60, two bedroom, one bath. They started working on it, and they just walked off of it. Oh, my goodness. So there's no electrical panel in there anymore. The wiring is showing. Right. And so I need electricians, plumbers, carpenters, uh, roofers. To and, volunteer their time yeah. for this ministry. And how long have you been working on this? I, like I said, I started this in uh, 2007. And how many trailers do you have? Well, right now, if we don't get the ones out of uh, Utagal, that's seven mobile homes down there we got to get out of there. Mm-hmm. Because the city of uh, Utagal is after us for it. Okay. And that's, it will take at least three tanks of gas of fuel to move them out. Right. So that's around $300 for the permit. So you're looking at about maybe $500 to get them out of there and mm -hmm. move down 